Can you tell anything about what these people look like from the interior of their ship? All this rust, corrosion. Perhaps animals have moved things around. Hard to know what we're looking at. Let me look. Try not to disturb anything. Okay. Let me pull this wire. We might need this wire later. I'm gonna see if I can pull it down. First, shouldn't you turn the power off of the breaker box? Funny. What? That was a joke, Lo. Oh, yeah. Huh. <laughs> Stand back in case something comes down on our heads. All right, Governor. Like a dragon. Look at it. It's beautiful. Oh, thank you. Changing shapes. Mathematical progressions of ever more complex polyhedrons. Next time I suggest pulling a wire. No, no, I'm glad you did. What could that have been? Not a random electrical discharge. Maybe it's a kind of computer display. Maybe to the aliens who piloted this ship, it conveyed some meaningful information. But Did you guys not hear that screeching? Absolutely nothing. Anyway, why? Thank you. It still might be useful. That might be even more useful. Did any of you see? Was this here before that thing appeared? Of course it was. Do you think an electrical field can carry a solid object? Yes. It did. Yeah, let's have a look at that. It's a rod, engraved, five geometric shapes. Oh God, I don't remember what that was for. There's nothing else around here, I don't think. Hang on, what? There was something. Hang on. Chest. Well, I don't see any treasure. But there is. When we get back, the engineers are going to have a field day trying to figure out how this worked. Is that a compass or something? Some kind of device. I have no clue what it might be for. Hey, can I examine one of these people? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> yes. All right, let's go. Let's go. Follow me, assholes. What are you doing? Oh, engine. I can look at that. These engines are enormous, but there is no evidence of any type of combustion. No scorching, no oxidation. The design of this ship is not consistent with the vast geometric structures we've encountered so far. So this ship is not from around here? Not in my opinion. Perhaps they were stranded here, much like us. It's a possibility. Maybe, or maybe it's just uh, more primitive from this planet. From the well, whatever. Let's just move, 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 move. Come on. It could have been uh, from the people from this planet, but more primitive, and they never cleaned it up. I mean, look at all this. There's like boats. It's like wooden wrecks here as well. They're not geometric, are they? Brink. All right, let's get the hell out of here. Oh, I need a not shovel. Not just plants, but creatures too. I'm not an archaeologist, but these look like bones to me. But they are not lying where the animal died. They were placed here. Markers. A grave? Best guess. And now a home for those rat-like things. Hi, rat thing. I got a shovel. Dig. Are you just going to dig right in? That's right, yeah. With a shovel? You will yeah. destroy the site. Oh, no. I'm not doing archaeology right now, Brink. I'm looking for something to help get us home. Your name will live forever. As the bone-headed space hero who destroyed precious data at the first alien uh, archaeological site. Dude, there are many other mounds. My name live forever. As a commander of an expedition that disappeared and was never heard from again. Now get out of the way if you aren't going to help, Brink. This might take a while. 
There are two other mounds of brink. Did he insert that, that tusk thing up his butt? Because it certainly looks like it. What a fine accomplishment, Commander. Now we yeah. have a pile of meaningless dirt and bones. Maybe yeah, not. Cool. You never know when an alien bone will prove useful. If you know what I mean. Ah, oh, tusk. Yeah. This is That's... light, but it feels as strong as steel. Jawbone, yeah. What do you think? Was this the skull of a sentient being? Or a pet? Or a beast of burden? I don't know, yes. but I'm pretty sure it's dead. It's a strange shaped jawbone. The teeth still look strong. I can chop someone's arm off with that, can't I? Oh, hello. I think we can safely say this is not a natural weather phenomenon. How about a mirage? Anyone voting for it being a mirage? It knew we were here. It was trying to tell us something. Or show us something. Don't be too quick to anthropomorphize. How do we know what life looks like here? It might be alive. Or it might be some kind of automatic guidance system. We triggered it in that ruined ship and now it's leading us. You mean this is the last gasp of a holographic tour guide? Maybe. Or the Port okay. Authority. Maybe it's telling us we're under arrest. Come quietly or self-aiming lasers will toast us to cinders in 15 seconds. Stop it. Maybe you can think that's funny, but the last thing I need is some mischievous boy trying to give me the creeps. Boy? If I wanted to give you the creeps, I'd tell you that it was the ghost of a long-dead alien. How do you know it isn't a ghost? What? You think this is where aliens end up when they die? If it is, then this place better be hell, because it sure isn't my idea of heaven. Now you're starting to give me the creeps. I'm gonna see if I can enlarge the hole. Maybe there's something under here. Yeah, maybe something lives down in that hole. <laughs> The utterances of experts. Oh, yeah, let's take a hundred years. Or not. The ground is soft here. Loose. I think this used to be an opening, and over the years, wind has filled it up with sand and dirt. Here, let me see. Yes, that's right. You're probably right. That means the ground is treacherous. It could be hollow under there. Commander, I think it's time for an archaeologist to do the digging. I'm used to dealing with drifted soil. The shovel is yours, Brink. Just be careful. The ground's pretty unstable. My feet kept sinking. My whole training is to be careful. Sure Not to charge in with guns blazing. Finally, a good use for my extensive training. Is it a chance to fall in and die? Come on. Oh, fall and die already. Come on. Come on. Fall and die. Fall and die. Fall and die. I hate you. Fall and die. No. It's completely. I can't. No. Ah! <laughs> yeah. Okay, Break. called it. I couldn't to get fair. to him in time. I couldn't. Oh, it happened too fast. Oh, can we get dead. down there? How long a drop is it? Looks like the rubble has formed a ramp. Follow me. Jump on his corpse. Okay, go around then. Here he is. He's not moving. Brink. Boston. He's dead. Oh. Well. Shit happens. I should have been the one digging. Then you'd be the dead one. It was my responsibility to. Brink and I are not children or trained monkeys. We're responsible adults. It could have been any of us, and there's not a thing you could have done to prevent it. But I... to lose Brink, and we've only been up here. Look, you can't keep me safe, and I can't keep you safe. So there's no particular reason for us to stay together. Our odds of getting back to Earth are better if we work separately on figuring this place out. I don't like the idea of splitting up. 
Why? Because we're safer together? Yes. Ask Brink about that. Because Aww. maybe I won't know what I'm seeing without you to help me understand it. If you find something interesting, the communicators still work. Till then, adios. Ciao. Sayonara. A Wiedersehen. Maggie, it's against every rule of military action for an officer to be separated from his command. Boston, this isn't a military action. And you don't have a command. There's just you and me. And we both know exactly the same amount about this situation, which is to say, nada, nothing, zip. If we suddenly find ourselves facing an army, then you're in command again. Until then, adios, ciao, Ugh. sayonara, a Wiedersehen. Nobody likes you when you smart off like that. Yeah, all my psychological tests as a kid said that I didn't work well with others. So this is what failure feels like. <laughs> really, you don't know what failure feels like. Oh, we say good. What'd you describe? Oh, shovel. Sure. Looks like one of the control plates we found on Attila. Meow. Which of these do I use with this? One, two, three, four, five. It's only got four, right? I can't use these two things together. I can't use these two things together. Oh, dark tunnel, that sounds fun. Oh, ramp. Let's go ramp. Nice place. It's hot here, and it's glowing down there. Ooh, that looks safe. Ten to one, it's the power source. What There's is that thing there? All I need to do now is to find the light switch, or the plug, or the fuse box, or whatever makes this thing work. And it's bottom left is. Might help. Maybe a map, and I could use a sandwich, and a hot oh, yeah. box and a cold beer, or just a starship headed for home. Uh huh. Get a grip, Boston. Now I'll look back down the edge. Unattach the lens. Dear Lord, how do I get that? I don't remember a thing. I can see a lens way down at the bottom. It's something to do with this machinery, and I, of course, I can't get it yet, and I don't remember how to get it. I know it has something to do with this control panel. Oh, 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 oh. no, oh. Okay. That's fun. Nothing happened. Pretty sure there's nothing I can do right now, anyway. Oh, it's this thing. Ah, I remember this now. <laughs> I really don't know what I'm doing. I just have to get that thing down there to the lens and then have it to grab. Okay, I just have to have, have it go left a few times and then grab. Shit. Is that grab? I'm guessing that middle one is grab. Whoops, excuse me. Let's try that. Oh, I have to go, I have to go left a couple more.
Grab. I don't even know if that's grab. I'm assuming it is. Whoops. Exit, please. Thank you. Wasn't so bad. Oh, um, okay. Hot and glowing. If it isn't the power source, maybe I'm on the edge of hell. Lynn slot. Ah, oh, crap. So I have to. So I have to drop it in that lens slot, don't I? Or something. I don't remember what this even does, but I guess I'll find out. No, not that. No, what? Okay. Do I have to drop it? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I think that's drop, I, I don't, oh shit, I keep doing that. Let's see, let's see. Ah. Is that doing something? Ah. All right. Mission accomplished. So now everything's working or what? Operating normally. Okay. I don't really know what I just did. I guess it has something to do with power to everything. Anyway, I did a thing. I don't know what. Don't quite remember what that does. <laughs> uh, hiccup. What's up here, though? Oh, that's here. I think that might have just powered this stuff up. I'm, I'm not sure. Yeah, whip it out. Let's go down that dark tunnel. Because why not? I really wouldn't mind this game being remastered, actually. I think this would be a good one to remaster. Ah! Where are we now? This is an elevator, right? Oh, that's what there was. That lens thing to turn the power on to all this stuff, I think. Anyway. Everything's working well. It's all that matters. This looks like a command center. Glowing penile. Uh, I don't know if there's a glowing rod I need or something. Is this underwater? I see many undersea tunnels, all leading from the large central island to the smaller islands. So this is underwater. What is this, subnautica now? I don't think there'll be anything here, will there? Let's just check out our panels. 
Not panel. I think I need some glowing rods, don't I? Yeah. This crystal is lifeless. This hole is this hole is this hole is empty. It's an energized crystal. Hmm. I have nothing that can help. Okay. Uh, should we talk to McGaggy? Where is she? Hey Brink, you wanna talk, dude? <laughs> you dead. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. Alright, come on. This is low. This is Robbins. I'm sorry Brink is dead, but I don't think it's right for you to blame me for it. I don't blame you. It's not safe for us to be separated. It's not safe for us to be together either. In fact, <laughs> Boston, it's just plain not safe. Oh yeah, it's so much safer being a part. I'm sorry right? that I can't protect against every possible accident, but that doesn't mean it isn't better for us to stay together. Would you stop taking this personally, Boston? I'm no. doing my best to decipher the inscriptions that are all over the place here. Would you be any good at that? No. So please, go do what you're good at, and I'll stay where I am and do what I can do best. What am I good Penny, at? I found a plate like the ones in the asteroid that triggered our journey here. For all we know, any plates we find might send us on a voyage to the opposite edge of the galaxy. Tell you what, I'll keep looking for more of them and you decipher that language so we can read the directions. Great. You get to look for metal things lying around on the ground while I have to decode a completely alien language without any information about how they think or what they might be writing about. What you're good yeah, at. That's a fair division of labor. Yes, it is. Still looking for more of these plates, Maggie. While you're at it, see if you can find a big juicy steak. Or, Ooh. I'm not fussy, a nice salad, or even a couple of grapes. What about a rat? There's a lot of these rat things around. Got any ideas about our friendly ghost? Do you think it was trying to get one of us hurt? How can I know, Boston? But I think it was trying to show us how to get down here. Brink falling and getting killed, that was an accident. Whether the ghost is a sentient being or some kind of holographic guide, it led us into a different part of the complex, didn't it? Yeah, but is that good or bad? It's better than sitting around in the sunlight wishing for a swimming pool. As irritating as he was sometimes, I really miss having Brink around. There's nothing you could have done. Let it go. Thanks. Oh, it's There's a huge amount of energy flowing along this column. Another one of these engraved sticks. What are they? Wands? Batons? Bludgeons? Maybe some kind of handheld computer game. With my luck, it's a hand grenade. Right in there. I can't help feeling like this thing is some kind of key. But is this the key to this lock? And if it is, I, uh... how does it work? And why am I talking to myself? How long before I'm completely nuts? Oh, you can't just... I can't help feeling like this thing is some kind of key. Okay. But is this the... And if it is... And why am I... How long... Blah, 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 blah. Okay, so what? It's not that one? I know these... Are for those... Ah. Okay. Did I change colors? I hope this was a good idea. Oh, I just happened to choose the right one. So what is through this door? A death trap? A mad scientist yep. with a pretty girl and a talking robot? An alien cafeteria? Hmm. Why am I just standing here? After all, as Brink found out, the worst get in the thing door. that can happen is you can take one wrong step and you're dead. Yeah, 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 yeah. Get in the door. So much for the cafeteria idea. Boston, are you there? They use geometric shapes as a kind of combination for the locks. Boston, you won't believe where I am. I'm in a place filled with alien technology, the most fantastic things I've ever seen. And the machines are working. What are they doing? I don't know yet. I mean, they're really alien. Like nothing I've seen before. Don't go too fast, Maggie. I'll be careful, Boston. But it's not like we have time to use correct scientific procedures to test these things. Where are you? How can I get to you? I wish I knew. 
It's a sure thing you can't get here the way I did. I slid through a low tunnel in the rock, and then it kind of got filled with debris when the roof collapsed. You could have been killed. Gee, I guess this isn't safe. But if we'd been together, whoever went through the crack second would definitely have been killed. Keep that in mind when you're thinking about coming to save me. I uh. handled it just fine. Yeah, I guess you did. We're both doing okay, Boston. We'll find a way to connect up with each other when it matters. Uh, Maggie, good work. Thanks, Boston. Give me this. Oh, it's not a thing. I thought it was a thing. It's not a thing. Oh. Well. Uh -huh. Whoa, taxi. Can I examine this? I'm just curious. The tram seems to be made of crystal. No graffiti either. Uh huh. All right, let's go. I don't know where this goes. There seems to be very little of this game I remember. Well, I mean, I think I remember enough to to get this far anyway. Just probably not saying much. And I vaguely remember this. Now I know what my pet hamster felt like. Weakened door. Well. We can get some more. Don't you need two people to? O oh, I think you need two people to open this up. I could be wrong. I need some help to pry this door open. Shit. Nothing could open this door. down into the nexus of course that's how brink died I just noticed the lens This thing is so transparent, it's almost invisible. It doesn't look safe to walk there. I'm doing exploring! Okay. I can only get back to one. All good. That's fun. Bunch of displays set into the walls. Inscriptions here and there. I'd say it looks like some kind of museum. Symbols written on a plate. Looks like an alphabet. Oh, mine now. Strange glowing crystals. What do we have here? What's this one about? A cookie, or a pizza, cookie, a pill. Ah, dead dude. Gets goo on him. He turns to a blob. Okay. He's alive again, look at that. Hey, was this here before? Another one of these engravings on a stick.
That canister sure packs a punch. Uh. Anyway, door time. Oh, hello. Boston. Maggie, I found you. I wasn't aware that I was missing. You know what I mean. I found a way to get where you are. Through the museum, back that way. That's nice, Boston. If that's the museum, then I guess this is the library. I found out how to open doors back in the Nexus. There's a tram that leads out here. Look, Boston, I think it's great you're finding things out, but I'm trying to concentrate here. I feel <laughs> like I'm so close to making sense of some of this stuff, and I just want to stay here and keep working. All right? All sure, right. of course. I just... Anyway, I know where to find you, and you know how to get out of here if you want to. Thanks. Yes. When I learn something, I'll call you on the box, okay? All right. All right, yes, I, I won't bug you anymore right now. <laughs> All right, I won't bug you anymore. Excuse me. Is there anything else around here? No. Let me bug the console. I've decided that has to be a control console for a data retrieval system. When I use the controls, different inscriptions appear, sometimes different languages. If English comes up, I'll let you know. I'm thinking that maybe we should consider teaming up again. Why? I think the answer to getting home is here in these displays. You go out and explore like you have been, and I'll work at getting us home. When I you figure go out, out and play. I'll take you with me. No charge. You go out and play, and I might just let you talk There's to There's no doubt about it, Maggie. These ghosts are trying to guide us. Well, I wish one of them would come here and help me translate these inscriptions. You won't believe what I found, Maggie. The central island and the five rock spires around it aren't just connected by underwater trams. There are also light bridges leading from the spires to this amazingly transparent crystal above the center island. A bridge made from light? I know, it doesn't make any sense, but it's true. Their technology is so far advanced beyond ours that I don't know if anything could surprise me now. <laughs> 